Hello and welcome to BS Breaking. In this video, we will learn all the terms of psychiatry, which are very useful to study mental disorders. So, watch the complete video to prepare a good foundation of psychiatric knowledge. Before we start with our first term, do subscribe the channel for study-related updates. So, now we are going to start with our first term, and that is flight of ideas. A constant flow of speech in which the individual rapidly shifts from one topic to another. A connection between topics exists, but it is difficult to follow the speech. It is mostly seen in mania. Confabulation is filling of memory gap with made-up storage for the purpose of maintaining self-esteem. It is commonly seen in memory disorders. Next term is echolalia. Echolalia is repetition of speech of another person. This is seen normally in children and pathologically in conditions such as Tourette's and autism. Another term is echopraxia. Repeating the movements of another person is known as echopraxia. It is a feature of schizophrenia, Tourette syndrome, and some other neurological disorders. Another term is Neologism, newly coined words that only have meaning for the individual who mix up those words. Commonly, they are the part of delusional system. Next is vexy flexibility, having one's arms or legs placed in a certain position and holding that same position for hours. This condition is commonly seen in catatonia. Next is word salad, a mixture of words and phrases that have no meaning. Usually it is an indication of advanced schizophrenia. Grandiosity, an unrealistic sense of superiority, <coughs> a false belief of being a powerful and most important person. It is a type of delusion. Circumstantiality Unnecessary details and irrelevant remarks cause a delay in getting to the point. It is seen in individuals with abnormal thought process. Next is verbigeration. It is the purposeless repetition of words and phrases. It is commonly seen in obsessive personalities. Next is clang association. It is the repetition of words and phrases that are similar in sounds but in no other way. It, it occurs in schizophrenia and in the manic phases of bipolar disorders. Empathy is the capacity to understand or feel another person's experience from their point of view. The capacity to place oneself in another's position to understand his feelings and emotions is known as empathy. Tangentiality is a communication disorder in which the thought process of the speaker wanders away from the initial topic where they started and never returns to that actual topic of the conversation. Anhedonia, an inability to experience pleasure, it can also be understood as a feeling of emotional emptiness. It is seen in severe depression and as a negative symptom of schizophrenia. Next term is automatism. These are sequences of simple or complex but purposeless activities that occur without conscious control of the individual. Clouding of consciousness it is also known as mental fog or brain fog. It is a mental state involving a reduced awareness of the environment, <coughs> inability to concentrate and confusion. Deja vu is a feeling that one has lived through the present situation before also. It is an overwhelming sense of familiarity 
with unfamiliar situations. Hallucination is the perception of stimulus in the absence of external stimulus. It may be of auditory, visual, olfactory, tactile and gustatory type. Next is illusion. Illusion is the wrong or misinterpreted perception of actual stimulus. Negativism, a behavior or habit of doing the opposite of what is being asked. It is commonly encountered with young children.